Welcome to Make It Happen with me, your host, Maggie. Thank you so much for deciding to join me for season two. And I want to first take just a moment to apologize for my abrupt break that I took after episode number 24. When I set out to create this podcast, my goal was simple and super clear. It was to provide you with simple and impactful tips and information that would help you, particularly as it pertained to fitness and nutrition. Oh, and it had to be quick, 10 minutes or less, aside from the incredible interviews that I did with AJ Richards. But I wanted it to be impactful and make a difference. And I believe that I have, and I will continue to work too. I mean, I am back here, so don't worry about that. Here we are with season two. But what I didn't realize was just how much work it was. Actually, not the work, the time. I love work. Put work in front of me, I am good to go. But the time it took was way more than I ever imagined. And it took me away from my full-time gig of creating 15-minute workouts and leading my member base through monthly fitness groups, creating new nutrition programs for them, et cetera, et cetera. The time it took to actually brainstorm new ideas and then film and then edit and then market and launch everything was more draining than I anticipated. All in all, we can't do it all, but I will die trying. In all seriousness, I think that adding a podcast to my to-do list every week was maybe something that I shouldn't have done from sanity's sake. But here I am, I am back. I took a break, the break that I needed, and here we are ready for season two. And yes, there will be another break before season three, but we're not there yet. There is so much fun and awesome stuff that we have to talk about this season. So thank you again for being here. I appreciate it more than you know. Let's dive into today's topic because aging, while it's something that is inevitable, I think that we all want to age the best that we can. If you're looking for ways to fight aging, you may have come across the word autophagy before. But just in case you haven't, autophagy is cellular cleansing. It's basically your body's internal cleanup crew that helps to get rid of cellular junk and replace it with healthier cells. So this keeps your body young and resilient. You may have heard of autophagy as one of the benefits of intermittent fasting or time-restricted eating, but that's actually not what we're here to talk about today. New research suggests that something else might be even more effective at the cellular cleanup process and keeping your cells young and healthy. There isn't an on-off switch for stimulating autophagy in our bodies, by the way. It's more like a dimmer switch. Basically, throughout the day, certain actions can stimulate that level of cleansing that's going on in your body. Fasting is one of those actions because when no calories are coming in, your body actually starts eating up old, unhealthy, and damaged cells to regenerate new, strong, and healthy cells to replace them. And the new research? Well, it suggests that resistance training might be even more impactful and powerful to stimulate this process. And hallelujah, because I love talking about the benefits of exercise, especially resistance training. It works by placing mechanical stress on the muscles, stimulating cellular cleanup, and allowing muscles to both recover and grow stronger. The result? Well, cleaning up and clearing out damaged cells and promoting muscle health and longevity. Plus, it's sustainable no matter who you are. You may not dabble in intermittent fasting, but you better be doing some strength training. And this is just one more great reason why. It is widely known that resistance training is a controllable action that you can take to stay young. Having more muscle and strength is associated with a longer and healthier life. Particularly as we age, maintaining muscle strength is crucial because it directly correlates with mobility, independence, and overall quality of life. And I don't know about you, but the thought of growing old and being weak, frail, or unable to do the things that I really enjoy just doesn't sound good to me. I want to be strong, resist injury, and be able to do the things that I love. Strength training is something we can all make time for, and a little goes a long way. And it's so impactful at keeping us young. And now with this new research suggesting that it also helps us to stay young at the cellular level, sign me up. That's it for today. In case you're new here, are ready to start a resistance training program and you haven't worked out with me before, there is no reason that you shouldn't run over to Amazon Video right now, type in Maggie Binkley, pick a workout, and start. 
My 15 minute workouts are free with your Prime membership in the US and I have both body weight only workouts and workouts that use weights, bands, or sliders. And if you're looking for my newest workouts and 24 seven support, come join my crew. I'll leave links in the show notes so you can find my workouts on Amazon easily and more information about joining my crew. And your first month is free by the way. Thank you again for being here. Now get out there and make it a great day. You deserve it, go make it happen. Mm -hmm.